Let's go. Certified makeup artist in 2020. You get me? <laughs> You get me? Hi guys, welcome, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, what is up? My name is Laura. Subscribe to the family with Let's Period. You know the vibes. And then if you are a returning Gem Baby family member, which means you're subscribed, which means your bell is on, which means you and me together on this journey together forever. So thank you guys so much for coming back. I always, always appreciate it. If you're new, make sure you subscribe. I promise you, you will not regret joining this video so today. As you guys can see from my face, I redid a makeup look that most of you guys are familiar with. I did my first get ready with me. I did like a green type of look. Now, I didn't know what I was doing, but after taking a course, which I will be talking about in this video, I am able to do this. So yeah, if you want to find out how I achieved this and how I got to achieve this, then definitely make sure you continue watching this video. I love you guys and I hope you enjoyed the video. Okay guys, so... I am using my mic because it's a bit rainy outside so if it's a bit like disruptive I'm really sorry but I am fighting with the rain outside okay so on this video I have a special special video for you guys today so I will be redoing my makeup the exact look I um, did in my first get ready with me if you guys haven't seen it go check it out but I'll put the picture over here so the aim and the plan is to redo that make that that whole look right so i'm really excited because as you guys have seen from the intro it's going to be an improvement from what i had done in that video because the team from online makeup academy uh, reached out to me and they offered me to take one of their makeup courses so in this video as i'm doing my makeup i'm going to be explaining to guys to you guys what online makeup academy is what they're about if i'd advise it and you know just telling you my own personal experience so guys let us not waste time my skin is prepped i've moisturized and i have primed so yeah i think the focus today is gonna be the eyeshadow okay so let's get right into it okay guys so my lights will be changing a bit because i don't know this weather it keeps changing the lighting so if it gets a bit weird i'm really sorry for that but anyway i will first talk about what online makeup academy is so they are a makeup school based in new york originally so they decided to branch into online um type of um classes because of um covid initially that was the reason but then after they saw how successful it was you know the online courses and classes and how it was convenient for people the online makeup academy focuses on um basically equipping um aspiring makeup artists and as well as professional artists i feel like on that side there is a course for everyone whether you're like an amateur like myself or you're like a professional makeup artist i feel like there's something on that side for you that you can um, take to um, help with your career as a makeup artist personally i was um given access to the master class um course so there's like about i think um about six type of courses that they offer so the first one is the master class beginners course so that's the one i took so basically i learned about the basics of makeup basic information like eye shape face shape guys it was a lot of things okay so i'll try to remember all of them but it was very very extensive i was very quite actually I'm shocked that it was that extensive so anyway the course I took was about you know makeup basics brushes um, face shapes eye shapes contouring um, natural makeup and all that good stuff that is basic that you need as you begin makeup okay so I'll offer the elite course and the special effects course so these are different um, level wise you can pick whichever you want to um, take and I feel like they're all very very beneficial depending on the level of your makeup artistry you give. Anyway, now I'm gonna talk about my experience basically with the masterclass I took. So first of all, they sent me an access um, a link to my masterclass um, course right so before I could even access a master class course they sent me like a really heartwarming um, video it was one of the tutors there her name is Alina I, I, I think they sent me a heartwarming video in my email like a personalized one welcoming me and even like saying my name so I feel like that was very 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 impressive um, after I got the welcome message I clicked on the link the access link that they sent me i don't know what i was expecting but i wasn't expecting the course and the contents of the site to look that professional when i tell you i was intimidated guys <laughs> i was intimidated because it felt like okay i'm actually at school 
but it was online you know everything was so professionally placed you know at first i was intimidated but then i realized it's actually you know placed in such a way that you it, it's easy it's very easy for you to navigate through you know you won't even get lost trying to find your way and if you have a question you can simply ask your tutors which are easily accessible which i thought thought was also a very impressive thing i don't know i, I mean i like when people show that they actually really want to help you and that is what i got from taking this course first thing lecture was a welcome video which i will put just now vacation experience and the physical school we have had a school in new york city for many years and we have worked with all kinds of students and it was always amazing but we've decided with this whole situation that the world is taking us to do an online version of what we have learned in real life and guess what so she's basically just explaining what online academy is and what they're about and what to expect in the course right so i watched that and then the modules or the course is broken down into like different sections right so that in the different sections you go through a lecture so for example there was one of my favorite lectures was um goal setting as a makeup artist so i personally believe in goal setting as you guys know from the ogs that um know me and have been on my channel you guys know that i am big on goal setting i am big on self-improvement and just you know um reaching your ultimate best as a person so i felt like that video or that lecture for me was very very needed and it was 18 minutes guys so that's how very important goal setting is and i was really impressed that they included something like that you know so every time you finish a lecture it tells you you have completed how many percent you know to kind of like help you to keep track of how far you are from finishing the course and you know now what i like about this course is that you can go back and watch, watch the lectures if you haven't understood anything and if you need help you can simply email your tutor or send them a message which is really really helpful and you can take your time with those courses because the link will give you access for a lifetime <laughs> as long as you've like paid for your thing then you can get access to the courses or the course that you took for a lifetime so you can just go back um, which is what i was doing i would go back rewatch, and just polish up on things you know i had learned and want to remember or remind myself on so i was impressed by the color wheel i think i was very very fascinated by that one which i will show on my screen so basically the color wheel is just um teaching you a lot of things on how to color correct so on today's video i will not actually show you guys or like do a color correcting type of thing but i think the focus is my eyeshadow today so basically on my next makeup videos you guys will see me color correcting my hyperpigmentation and you know my sunburns and everything guys i'm an expert now okay so <laughs> you guys gonna tell me anything i i speak makeup language now period okay so you guys would be shocked at the amount of diversity that goes into eye shapes and eye shapes face shapes skin tones guys there's, there's an olive i am a olive undertone <laughs> and a dark shade okay so guys when i tell you you need those cores you need this course okay so let me just get straight into my eyeshadow because that's the one i'm really really excited for because i learned a lot guys okay so i think another thing i forgot to mention is that during the course it's like school guys during the course when you finish a lecture you may be given a quiz or a test or an assignment which was what i was basically doing i found it really interesting and it's good to keep track of your this is not allowed using hand <laughs> you use a palette guys oh you get homeworks you get quizzes and then you get assist which i think gives you a real you know school experience if that's what you're like kind of going for you will get that you will get the ex experience yeah i also liked the module that they have you know a module gives you a course outline and what you're supposed to be doing in that course anyway the course outline looks like a magazine guys when i tell you if you're someone that um cannot keep um the concentration you know or have a long concentration span then the module is perfect for you because it's very aesthetically pleasing i'll show you on the side of the screen it's very aesthetically pleasing it is attractive you can go through the thing because it looks like a magazine and i feel like they put it in the most simplest way that anyone can understand the english is very understandable you cannot make an excuse okay okay guys so i've done this part of my eye i did it off camera so that i don't show you guys 
or things that do not know. But anyway, yeah, this is how it turned out. I'm gonna do the rest of the other eye as I tell you guys the rest of the details of the course and just to kind of like conclude on whether you should take it or not. So, um, yeah, I removed the mic because it was falling out of the thing. So anyway, I'll try to speak as loud as I can. So another con to this um, course is that you get a certificate at the end of it. So you become a certified makeup artist. So I feel like this is very beneficial if you're someone that wants to do gigs. And I feel like it's a pointer to kind of like tell whoever is going to be, you know, hiring you that, okay, you know what, I'm actually you know, a certified makeup artist. I feel like it just gives you pointers and it makes you stand out as a makeup artist wherever you will go. So yeah, you get a certificate and then you get um, access cards or discount cards to brands like Estee Lauder. So if you wanna buy makeup, you can buy makeup from these big brands. I'll put them on the screen at a discounted price. So I think it's a really, really great opportunity, guys. So I'd advise you take it. Um, if you are planning on taking this course, please do make sure you use the code that is going to be in my description box on or on my screen right now. Guys, I really, really advise you take this course. I feel like it's very, very beneficial. And especially if you're someone that is currently at home or out of school and you're still waiting maybe to go to school, um, I think as you wait, you can simply take this course because it won't... If you're really serious, I don't think it would take you more than a year, you know? So I think it's important to have that skill as a young woman or a young man. Um, just have an extra skill on top of what you want to pursue um, permanently or in the future, you know. It's good to have options. It's good to be a, a, a diversified, you know, lady. You know, you have to have skills on the side. For me, I'm not professionally planning on doing makeup, but I am planning on, now that I've learned, you know, a thing or two, I'm planning on... You know, taking makeup as a side hustle, I plan on doing it and making it a side hustle for myself. So guys, if you're planning on having a birthday party or like, you know, a birthday dinner with your friends, then definitely make sure you hit me up. I will hook you up, okay? I think by the time I start doing makeup on others, I will have polished up my skills for sure because I can go back and rewatch the lectures and you know you can trust me to have the skill to provide you the service that you need anyway thank you so much to online makeup academy for sponsoring this video i'm so 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 grateful and i hope you guys actually take this course because i really i think it's really really beneficial so thank you guys so much to online makeup academy and yeah i really really enjoyed working with you and your course was amazing so guys let's continue with this look i think i want to explain a little for y'all as I finish it off so at this part which is my crease I'm just putting like a bright color which is yellow and then directly underneath I'm gonna go in with yellow as well yeah directly under the eye I'm just going in with yellow I don't think I will want to talk because the talking is disturbing me that time I want to impress you guys so yeah and then if you want to clean up you just take a clean sponge and then just go under I promise you it's gonna move yeah just like that and then at the corner of my the corner I'm gonna take a darker color of green I'll just mix the light with that take this green or this one and just mix dust it off and then go gently underneath my eye as if joining that upper crease right with this goldish color i hope you guys are seeing <laughs> i hope i'm not waving this thing and you guys are not seeing i'm just gonna go underneath Hi. this brush i don't know i forgot what it's called but i'm um, yes yeah, to kind of like blend out you know if it's looking too heavy just blend it out and then if you want to avoid fallouts, just put powder under your eyes and like this. And then this side, I'm going to go in with my black eyeliner. I, I mean, my brow pencil. I couldn't use brown because it was looking a little off, so I just decided to use black. So, I'm still learning, obviously, so not everything's going to be perfect. So then I'm going to take a smaller brush, kind of like this one. 
to blend out the eyebrow pencil because it's looking really dark right now and I don't like when it looks like that so I'm just gonna blend it with the brush just like that just like that and then if you want to perfect the, the arch of your eyeliner I'm just gonna take your is this concealer which I don't have to you know just take me for a minute Guys, please comment down below if you say difference and be honest please don't lie because I can say right there guys please but personally I think I, I did something okay <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you really 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 enjoyed it once again thank you guys so much from online makeup academy for sponsoring this video i really 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 appreciate it so i'll see you guys on my next video definitely make sure you subscribe if you haven't already and yeah subscribe and make sure to be tuned in for my next video so i love you guys and i'll see you guys later bye